Hello, my dear beauties! Today I'm coming back with a new hair tutorial on the most popular hairstyles this season, in particular those trending on Instagram. All of them are super easy, even beginners can recreate them, and they will take you just a couple of minutes. And if you don't follow me yet on social media, Facebook, Snapchat, Instagram, I'm going to put all the links in the description box. This way we can stay connected because even when I don't have a chance to post new videos here on YouTube, I stay very active on social media. I'm sharing with you photos from my trips, my fashion, beauty, hair favorites, almost every day. And currently my feed has turned almost completely pink with photos of cherry blossoms that I've taken in Japan and in Paris. So feel free to add me. Beautiful hair is your best accessory. So I'm going to start from attaching my glam time clip and hair extensions. In a matter of minutes, they give me all the length and volume that I need. I like my extensions wavy, but I don't like to damage them with high heat tools. That's why I often use jumbo curlers, soft bendy rollers that can be used overnight on dry or slightly dampened hair. In one of my previous videos I've already shown you how to use them, so feel free to check it out. You'll find the link on the screen and in the description box. I'm going to start from presenting you the biggest hair trend this summer. It's all about decorating your hair with a beautiful flower headband. Here you can see just a couple of my favorite headbands, and as you can tell, I'm placing them in such a manner that the flowers are at the back of my head. That's a perfect way to wear a headband if you want to take a beautiful picture from the back, which is something that you can see on many Instagram models. I think that's a perfect solution for the days when you can't be bothered with your makeup, yet still want to take some beautiful pictures. Now if you need to get a picture-perfect look from every angle, here's my best trick to hide the part of the headband which is not covered with flowers. Grab a strand of hair, place it over the headband and secure in place with a bobby pin or a tiny clear elastic band. And there you have your beautiful hairstyle, which will look perfect in any kind of a picture. You could even bring it to the next level, replacing the small strand of hair with a tiny braid. Now let's gather all the loose hair into a low ponytail. I'm going to release a couple of strands at the sides, just to frame my face. Now to give this ponytail the trendy touch, you want to slightly loosen it up by tugging on the hair above the elastic band, just like this. Here you have to remember that less is more, so repeat the same procedure several times without overdoing it. Hide the elastic band with a strand of hair and secure its end with a small bobby pin. This way you can get quite a voluminous stylish ponytail without having to tease your hair. And as we all know, teasing can be at times damaging for sensitive hair. Plus, this technique gives more natural results. And while elegant ponytails never go out of style, bubble braids are really trending right now. So I'm going to grab my first clear elastic band and create a small bubble at the base of my ponytail. At first I simply tie my hair and then I'm going to tug on it to give my bubble its proper round shape. Here the main trick is to pull only on the superficial layers of hair. Next I'm going to create two more bubbles in the same manner. I tie my hair with a small elastic band and then I tug on each bubble to give it that nice round shape. Once it's done, I get my modern hairstyle perfect for every day. But that's when we can transform it into a hairstyle for special events using very special accessories. Fresh flowers. I simply insert their stems into my hair in such a manner that they're held in place by the hair tie. Here you could play with different types of flowers on one condition. You have to make sure that your flowers are really super fresh. Because what I learned from my own experience is that if you use old flowers, their stems can become super soft and really hard to keep in place. Of course, you wouldn't have this problem with artificial flowers, so it's always the safer version. Here you can actually see me struggling with the last bubble. Seriously, decorating your own hair is quite a challenge, but as you can tell, if you're determined to do what you have to do, nothing's impossible. And now I'm ready to show you the finished look. Let's just take a moment to admire the beauty of fresh flowers. Ever since I started using them, I simply don't want to stop. I think I need to create more special occasions in my life. 
because seriously, this look is perfect for a very special event. I also couldn't resist my temptation to show you one of my favorite casual hairstyles, a big messy bun. I grab my hair with one hand as if I wanted to put it into a high ponytail and arrange all the ends evenly around the base. Then I grab it with one hand, like so, and secure in place with a hair tie. Please note that's the only hair tie that I use here. Once my hair is secured, it's actually going to look quite weird. That's when I want to start stretching it and arranging it into a more interesting shape. I keep on tugging on my hair till I'm happy with the amount of volume I obtained. And finally I secure my bun with a couple of bobby pins. At this point I also like to release a couple of strands to frame my face. They're going to give my hairstyle that stylish, effortless look. One last touch that will make this hairstyle totally on trend is going to be a scrunchie. If you didn't notice yet, the 90s fashion is totally back in style. And while in general I'm not a huge fan of the fashion of 90s, I find this kind of a scrunchie quite cute actually. And how about you? What do you think about the 90s fashion? Let me know in the comments under this video. And by the way, if you like messy buns as much as I do, I've made another video on 10 easy techniques to put your hair into a messy bun. If you missed the tutorial, the link is on the screen and in the description box, so feel free to check it out. Thanks for watching and see you soon. Bye!